Intake manifold gasket on a 90, 1996 Ford Thunderbird 4.6 liter overhead cam. Got the uh, air cleaner and uh, air tube assembly off the way, just 8 millimeter or 5 sixteenths. Clamps, get those out of the way. Pull the tube off here, tube off here, off the idle air control. So we're good there. Let me just start disconnecting things here. Go ahead, yeah, fire it up. So you get to wrestle with it. Fiberglass. <laughs> the fuel lines here, but I need a special tool to disconnect the fuel lines right there. Do that a little bit later. Later's good. We'll just connect the battery too, probably to be safe. And we got this bracket here. Take that off.
I want to get this harness out of the way. It looks like it goes down to the air conditioning unit and down to maybe a crank sensor down below. So we need to follow this harness down below and disconnect it so we can get that harness out of the way. So here's the crank sensor on the bottom of the Ford engine. Right there is the tang, just to push on the tang. Mine's been zip tied here, I'll have to cut that off so we can pull the harness up and uh, can barely see the air conditioning compressor connector right up there. You have to take that off the compressor as well. Just use a screwdriver to get that off. So we can in this off now. There we go. We'll pull this harness up. There's the drain on the radiator too. Lefty loosey righty tighty. Right, well, I'll loosen that up so we can get some fluid draining out of here. This is on the uh, passenger side of the radiator underneath. Watch your business, citizens. I went in the office just to make sure that Angel was going to name me. It was George Fury. Oh, what is it? It says that, uh, fuel lines. Hey, got the special tools for the fuel lines. <laughs>
to drain the coolant on the petcock that I showed you earlier. Two 10 millimeter bolts for the alternator. PB? I'm not sure. Maybe it's on the uh, hoist over there, maybe there. Take out these uh, 10 millimeter bolts along here. One in the back there. We'll get the, take that hose off too, that's right. Take that hose off. 10 millimeter bolts for the intake. No, your face is not, so just hold the zip as high as you can. Hola! Gracias. Thanks, man. See you. I knew it was something you could handle. Both bolts here on the thermoset housing.
replacing this because this thing had a crack in it. So you can't see it very well, but it's cracked and it was leaking right there. Uh, basically, remove re reverse procedure to install. And good luck to you. I'll get you some torque specs, I'm sure, quick. So here's the new intake we're putting on because of that cracked fitting, and we'll be transferring some parts, uh, fuel lines there, fuel rail, sensor, a couple sensors. Uh, just transfer parts. If you're doing this job like I am, uh, they give you a new kit. A new bag of parts. So we'll just put that stuff uh, wherever it needs to go. Just get a screwdriver in there and uh, pry those out and maybe just put a little uh, lubricant on the injector o-rings. Put them back in. We got a new thermostat in the kit, so we're putting the thermostat in first, then the O-ring, and then we'll put the uh, housing on top once we bolt it up. Just got to transfer uh, two, two D-leave hoppers there, and it'll be good. Using a 19 millimeter wrench on the two uh, sensors, they're coming out. Using a little bit of uh, sealer. Probably use a little RTV maybe on the threads when you put it in the uh, new intake, if that's what you're doing. You do want to use some kind of solvent or cleaner or wire brush on this. I got a wire brush on a gun here that I'm using. Gasket area here, so just uh, remember to clean this stuff up. A rag and some carb spray or some brake cleaner might do a good enough job. Razor blade, maybe, or some plastic scrapers, specifically for scraping gaskets. Alrighty, so the intake is in. 10 millimeter bolts are uh, 18, mil 18 foot pounds of torque. It's a good idea to go across back and forth and tighten them up from the middle. Work your way to the outside edges. 18 foot pounds. I uh, hope this has helped you do your intake.